different prop design here. Um, as far as it's just yeah, regular... I don't know. That looks kind of weird, man. What is going on, guys? Danny with X over here. In this video, I wanted to show you a new frame I've been working on. Uh, this has been an idea that I've had in my head for such a long time. I was like, you know what? I'm just going to sit on Fusion 360, design it, see what it looks like. If it looks like it's going to be something good, then we'll move on. But I thought I'd make a video of the whole process here for you guys. So I'll show you what I got so far. Um, and this is basically a sub 250 with a naked GoPro option. Uh, it'll work with like other cameras too, like the Sumo 4K or anything similar to that. There's prop guards on it. It's going to be all carbon fiber, as you can see. There's literally no 3D printed parts on here. You can see where the GoPro is sitting. It's sitting you know, way below the FPV cam. And the whole reason behind that is I feel like the footage coming off from a lower GoPro rather than sitting on the top plate should look a little bit better, especially if you're using it like for commercial uses, um, movies or anything like that. I think the footage is going to make a little bit more sense having the GoPro sitting a lot lower. Um, it's pretty cool is you can actually remove these plates and put them back here and then you can have a rear facing GoPro or just keep the plates on there and then you can just switch the GoPro from depending on the shot that you're looking to get. I know the frame looks a little weird but I think it should fly pretty good. I'm predicting it's going to be under 240 grams. It's a little bit long but for some reason it looks really big on the software. I think once I cut it, it'll look really small and it'll make sense. You can see that it's gonna be a type build also. So it's gonna be an all-in-one FCESC, the Vista Caddx back here. Still need to make a 3D printed part for the for the antenna. But other than that, I'm actually excited to get it cut and then take you guys along the journey here. So next video is gonna be of us on the CNC cutting it out. And then after that, we're going to build it and we're going to fly it and we're going to find out together if it flies good or not. I'll have the maiden uh, uh, flight here on camera. So I uh, hope you guys like these type of videos and I look forward to doing more. Let me know what you think in the comments below, if it's going to fly good, if you have any suggestions, if you think it's going to fly bad. Hope you guys enjoy this. And as always, thanks for watching. Make sure you leave a comment and like and catch you on the next one.